picture among the 166. Oh, yes. Okay. Yes. What is your reason for that? The reasons are so clear. Mm -hmm. We know Sicily is a woman. We are also women. And we don't want to fail our president. When he appointed these ministers, he did not tell them to go and break the law, to go and disrespect people, to go and do acts without investigation. He did not tell them that. He told them to go deliver and work on my legacy. And that is why we want to support the president on that. When I come to the issues of Sicily, I have no personal uh, issues with Sicily. As much as my colleague is saying, Sicily has come to clean up the mess. I don't, I don't, I don't agree with her. She's actually messing the Ministry of Health. And these are the reasons. Let me start with Dr. Koros. Dr. Koros is also a woman who does not deserve to be dismissed on a live television, on a press conference. When this matter has happened, actually it is the board that's supposed to take up that matter, not the minister. And in this case, the minister is the highest accounting officer. If she's dismissing Koros, then she should have also followed the suit. She was to step aside because she has to take the responsibility as the minister and the accounting officer. Why was Koros dismissed? Doctor's negligence, who is, supposed, who is responsible for doctor's negligence? Is this the CEO or it is the board? Why did she call the board on a Sunday? I agree with my sister, my senator. There's so many issues that happened in KNH. But there's a time women's MP went to KNH to go and get the facts finding and know the situation in hand. The report with God, it was not, it was not, uh, it was not good. The, the, the doctors and the CEO were called in front of the health committee. And the kind of things we had, I can, from where I sit, we don't want to use our powers as women. When we are getting, when we got, or we are given opportunity to serve the country as women, we go undermine other women. Mm -hmm. Or we bring, we, bring, we bring down other women. It's called PhD, pull her down. Mm -hmm. KNH, there are a lot of cartels in KNH. Koros was fighting the cartels. She has to, she has to, now she's paying the price for fighting the, the, the cartels. All these things are state managed. All these things was a setup for her. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you'll definitely support I, this motion. I want so to support. Don't think that, I want to support this motion. Mm. And the reasons again, I want to support. There's the issue, issues of Kemsa and Kemri. There was an interview that was done on 27th of July by body called uh, Manpower Services. It's a it's a human resource mm -hmm. farm. Mm -hmm. When they did the interview they sent six names to the board, Kemsa board. They again did the interview on 20th. Yeah? When they did the interview, Dr. Wako, the head of malaria now, became number one in the interview. The board submitted three names to the minister. Dr. Wako came number one, Joseph Sitane number two, Magari Mwangi became number three. Because the minister, once Mwangi, who became number three, she has to re-advertise. But don't you think that some yeah? of these issues, and especially what you've listed, all those things, what? that these are issues that the Health Committee of Parliament can actually summon the CS to appear before it and answer, explain herself, mm -hmm. instead of going, because impeachment is a very serious process. And dragging through a CS through this kind of mud uh, will definitely affect her performance either way, whether or not it goes through or not. Of course, but it is not us to tell the Health Committee to do their work. It is their work and mandate to call them. 
when these things happen, the health committee are there and they can see the country. They can see the headlines. Don't, they don't do not think, call the don't you think this I is think parliament. Majority of the people who signed for that petition are people from her own constituency. Cecily, she has no regrets. There were a lot of issues. When member of parliament go to her office, the, she tells her, put your phones aside. A mayor sees who we vetted. She's disrespecting members of parliament. Right now, there is issues of seventh floor in Afia House. That is public funds. Why are you dis 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 displacing staffs and you want to create a big space for you so that you can put gym, kitchen, a big office? Is she superior CS? Those are the issues we have. Our issues are not personal.